Beloved in Christ, as the time grow near of the return of the Lord Jesus Christ, it is coming to a day where Satan will begin to uh, demand or to call you out to see where you stand as a Christian. You know, it was him who called out uh, to God to allow him to work over uh, Job. Uh, but beloved, if we are put in positions in this life today, we have to be very mindful that it will be the voice of the devil that is calling out the loudest in these latter days. And the Word of God tells us and encourages us in 1 John 4, 1, it says, Beloved, do not believe every spirit, but test the spirit to see whether they are from God. For many false prophets have gone out into the world. Beloved, there will be voices that are crying out loudly in these latter days. They will seem like they are Christian voices, but they are voices from the devil. And how do you determine that? You determine that through uh, the actions that they are calling for. Amen? That's how you determine... Uh, Satan's work. Satan's work always tries to appease to the flesh to get you to somehow get on his side no matter if he's a liar, a thief, condemned for damnation, he still want you on his side. And what he does to get you there is to offer you something that he says to you, God is incapable of giving you, just as he did in the Garden of Eden. He offered something to them that he said that God was holding back from them in this life. And this is where Satan attacks, is in the flesh. He wants you to want it now, to get it now. If he can get you to that part, that you believe that somehow you can get more by following his uh, 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 calling on your life, then he has you right where he needs you. First, he shows you a deficiency in your life. He said, if you had this, you would be so much better off. The flesh would be well taken care of. If you just had a little more money, or if you just did it this way, or if you joined this group that are advocating killing other people uh, in order to get their desires met, you don't have to do any killing yourself. You just have to belong to them and just be on the back side and you will be well understood. But beloved, when you are not of God and you are not willing to walk with Him and willing to walk with Christ who walked to the cross and gave His life for us, beloved, then you are following the footsteps of the enemy. And ultimately, His goal is to deceive you and then to enwrap you and to destroy you. For Jesus said, I have come to give life and to give it more abundantly. But Satan has come rather to steal, to kill, and ultimately to destroy. Beloved, let not an opening for the enemy in your life. Know Jesus and walk in him. Beloved, be blessed this day in Jesus' name.